you had to write a headline about what you're sensing in that environment right now, what would you write? And I'm going to start with you, John. I've got to say lean and mean because it's uh, going to be, they're trying to patch lean up $3.2 billion dollars in, in, in shortfall, plus almost everybody is running for another office, <laughs> many of them against each other. And you have the chairman of the Republican Party of Florida, John Thrasher, also a state senator from St. Augustine. So he's sitting right in the middle of it. Mine would be the Florida legislature's game plan is to punt and run out the clock. Um, and the reason for that is I think that they are not going to tackle any big issues. We're not going to see any resolution of some of the big things. You know, how do we bring jobs back into the state? How do we, um, what do we deal with the, you know, whether or not we go on to oil drilling, we, we drill off our coast. Um, how do we do serious Medicaid reform? Those things are not going to be done in an election year. They're all going to be handled next year. Hunt and run, okay? Yeah. Legislature, colon, let's get out of town. They want to get home and run for re-election? All they've got to, it's painful here, no money. I like really short, tight headlines. You ready? <laughs> ready. L lame, L-A-M-E, and here's why. We've got a lame duck governor, Charlie Crist, who's, who's, who the legislature shows no great fear or really you know, respect for. I mean, uh, they, they would never think of treating Jeb Bush the way they treated, acted toward Charlie Crist. And number two, lame in the sense that because there's no money, they're recycling all these old ideas. I mean, the hot button issue is things like whether there should be robotic cameras at intersections to catch people that run red lights and stuff like that. It's an important public safety issue, but I mean, the fate of Florida as a republic is not hinging on, on legislation like that, you know what I mean?